Hey guys, Grady's mom here, and I'm going to do an obnoxiously huge BJ's haul. I actually think this broke my record yesterday for the biggest BJ's haul I've ever done. So first and foremost, we are in my second bedroom of my um, our temporary apartment. So please excuse the fact that like half of our house is in here, like the stuff from our garage and everything. So this is the only place I had to store this ridiculously huge haul. This haul was $800, so I think that topped my biggest BJ's haul ever by about $150. This haul is stuff obviously we can use now, as well as some of the things that last us until the beginning, beginning of November that we're going to be using in our new home. So I'm just going to go ahead and jump right in. Um, again, excuse the fact that I'm in like pretty much a storage room right now. Okay. So um, I actually got two of these Gain um, laundry pods, which are just the pod version of laundry detergent. I got two of them. Um, I've already gotten into one, and it's in my laundry room right now. So I figured I would just show you one of the two that I got. I believe they were $20 each, but they're big. They have 90, yes, 90 pods per container. So I bought 180, two of them, obviously. So I assume that will last me well until we move into our new home. Um... I actually got two um, 32 packs of soda. I got a Diet Coke for myself and then a Dr. Pepper for my husband, Matt. So I got two 32 packs of soda, which will definitely not make it until we move, but it'll last for a while. Um, I got this huge pack of the Scott Shipping Heavy Duty Tape. I think this is eight, yeah, it's eight rolls. This was like $23, I think, but I had a coupon for this. Um, and I got this because I ship things to my mom um, pretty much every week. And also when we move again into our new house, we're going to need a lot of tape to package up all the boxes and stuff. So I got that. Um, I got a huge pack of the Little Bites chocolate chip, the little mini muffins. This is a 15 pack. So it's the 15 pouches. And Grady likes these for a snack. My husband brings them for lunch. So I got that. I got this huge... Um, package of the disposable coffee cups it's just the cups with the matching you know with the black lid um, for my husband to take his coffee to work in the morning um, he like he prefers to take it with him rather than go to like Starbucks or Dunkin Donuts every day so even the cost of the cups is you know it still ends up being a lot cheaper than stopping for coffee every day on his way to work I got actually two of these they are the fresh step 42 pound um, bags of cat litter for our cat obviously one bag is in the room with her litter box but I just figured I'd mention I got two of those extremely heavy it was like yeah pretty much 84 pounds so um, for two um, containers of that I got two of these dull mandarin oranges cups they're 16 per box so I got another one that's already in my pantry we actually already got into those last night Grady had a cup I got um this pack of Slim Jims, I think there's there's 50 of them. So as you can see, my husband already got into that too. So I got just this 50 pack box of the Slim Jim, just the snack size sticks. He likes to throw them in his lunch. I got the 36 count box of the regular Cheez-Its, again for lunches and snacks and things like that. I got two boxes of the Pirate's Booty, um, the White Cheddar, Corn puffs, so each box has 24. One is already in my pantry, so this is kind of just my overflow room, as you guys can tell. So I got two boxes of the Pirate's Booty. I got two cases of the Deer Park Sport. Um, th these are the flip cap waters, the big size. I think these are like, let me see how many ounces. These are 24 ounce bottles. So I got two um, cases of this. I got a huge thing of chips. Again, snacks and stuff for my husband's lunches. Just, it's good for me just to throw one in my bag, you know, my diaper bag, just things like that. So this is like, this is a 50 pack. So this is an obnoxiously huge pack of chips. As you can see, a lot of the things we've already kind of broken into in one shot. So that's that. I got three boxes of the Huggy size six diapers. These are, these are the big boy boxes. So these have 132 per box. These are two of them. The other box I have in my bedroom already um, that we're using for Grady right now. These boxes are about $40 each. So again, I got three of them. I'm guessing by the time we move, I might have one box left, but I'm not even gonna um, assume that. But I just got three just for them to last me for a long time. Okay. Then I have this other box with many different things in it. I bought three 
of these boxes. As you can see, we've already gotten into this. So these are the Annie's Organic Fruit Snacks, the variety pack. Each box has 24 packages in them, and these are just the assorted one, as you can see. So I got this one that we already got into, as well as two more. I got a huge box. These are 34 of the chocolate-covered um, granola bars. My husband likes those for lunch, and I like them too. I got a big box of the Mott's Medley's fruit snacks. There's 48 in this box. And then I got a variety pack of the Planners snack size bags. So these just have um, cashews, peanuts, and then honey roasted peanuts. And this is a 24 pack. And actually the packages are pretty big. Don't mind my cat who's being like a jungle animal right now. Okay. Um, then I got the Ritz crackers and cheese dip. I hate these. I don't like them. My husband likes them. So I got those for his lunch, um, lunches. I got a 24 pack um, snack size pack of the goldfish cheddar crackers. So I got that. I got a big case of the Mott's single size serve apple juice. There's 24 in here. Um, pretty heavy. I got a 36 pack of the Apple and Eve 100% no sugar added juice boxes. And this is a variety pack. So it has apple, fruit punch, and berry berry for Grady. I got a Starbucks Frappuccino mocha flavored pack of 12. And these are the ones that come in the, the glass bottles. I'm like kind of working my way through this pile, you guys. This is like the craziest haul I've ever done for BJ's. I got um, a big box of the always just maxi pads for, you know, your monthly friend. Nothing too exciting there, but this is a 90 pack. So this will last me for a while. I actually normally use tampons, but sometimes I just, you don't want to use a tampon for whatever reason. So I just got these. This will probably last me like a year because I usually use tampons. Like I said, sorry if that's TMI. I got um, a huge pack of the donut shop. K-Cups, this is an 80 pack. I think this was like 40 bucks, I want to say. Sorry I'm forgetting to tell you guys the prices on everything, but I can't remember them all. Um, so this is for my husband. I like the Cafe Bustello K-Cups, which is like a really, really dark roast, and my husband likes a medium roast. So I got him this, which will last probably a couple months, I'm guessing. He drinks like one cup a day, maybe two, so I can probably get like a good month and a half out of this. So I got those. I got a six pack of the organic um, diced tomatoes. I actually got two of these, come to think of it. I got two six packs of the organic diced tomatoes, which I use for all different cooking, chili, soups, um, goulash, just anything where you need diced tomatoes, Mexican food, so I got that. I got um, a two pack of the heavy duty Reynolds wrap aluminum foil, and these are the big boxes. They have 125 square feet per box, so I got a two pack of that. I'm going to have an avalanche here in a minute, guys. You should see like a bird's eye view of this room. It's crazy. I got a big package of the Colgate Max Fresh um, toothpaste. I think there's, yeah, five unless I'm saying things. There's five big tubes. I got a three-pack of the Q-tips, the big boxes, like the family size boxes of Q-tips. I got a three-pack of that. I got a six-pack of the scalloped and our gratin potatoes. I actually really like making these. I have no problem using store-bought items as side dishes. So I got a six pack of these, which will last me a while. I got a six pack of the cotton rounds just for removing my eye makeup, um, my mascara, things like that. I also use these to take off my nail polish. I also use these for my facial toner. Just kind of a good all-around cotton pad. So if this will last me a while, it's a six pack. I got a 12 pack of the Annie's white cheddar shells, just the macaroni and cheese. Um, I make these probably at least, I make like one box a week, so this will last me for quite some time. I got a big box of the Glad Force Flex, just standard size garbage can bags, 130 pack. I actually got two of these, which are just the Cascade Platinum dishwashing pods. Um, again, two of them. One of them is already in my kitchen because I had completely run out, so I'm using that. This box probably will, um, won't even be opened until we move. Um, there are 80 uh, pods in each box or in each package, so that'll last me quite a while. Got a huge thing of bounty paper towels. There are 20 of the jumble rolls in here. 
So yeah, that'll last me a good amount of time. And then I got the hugest Scott toilet paper thing I could get. These are actually individually wrapped, which I found kind of weird. Um, I would have thought they just would have come already unwrapped, but these actually have like the paper wrapping on them, if that makes sense. I can't even get back there far enough to see how many are in here, but I'm assuming this is like a 24 or a 32 pack. I got a big thing of, oops, oh my God, you guys, you should see the, the floor right now. I got a huge bulk package of these Kleenex tissues. I think there's eight big, huge boxes. I've already used one, so that's why that's open. Over there hiding, I can't even get back there. There is a um, five pack of the Lysol wipes or the Clorox Lysol wipes. So there's two green, two yellow, and one orange. And I think that's it for this room. And I'm gonna move into the kitchen now and show you just a few things I got that are refrigerated. Okay guys, as for my cold things or things that just weren't in that room, I got a two pack um, of the honey wheat bread. Um, already have gotten into this loaf, but I got a two pack. They just sell them two packs together in one bag. I got a pound each for my husband's lunches and myself as well for the week. Just cheddar cheese, buffalo chicken, honey ham, and hard salami. So I got a pound each of that for the week. I got a five pack of these little portable snack pouches or snack packs. They just have cheese, nuts, and then like smoked turkey. Just something quick to throw in my husband's lunches. I got a big, um package of the sweet Italian sausage and inside of the sausage there's broccoli rabe and um, Romano cheese. This is I think like a three pound, I don't even know how many pounds, yeah this is like just over three pounds. So what I'll do is I'll break them into three separate bags, so a pound each, so I can get three dinners out of this package, um, which I thought was good. I got two of these big bags of green beans. Um, I, we already got into one bag last night, so this is just the other bag, what it looks like. It's pretty large. Um, I think this is two and a half pounds of just the fresh green beans, so I'm gonna make all kinds of things this week. I got a box of the Elio's cheese pizza for my son, and actually I like it too. And we actually like the cheese because we just add our own toppings, whatever the case, you know, whether it's pepperoni or olives or whatever. I just throw them right on the pizza and then you make whatever flavor that you want. And lastly, I got a three pack of the center cup bacon. This is a big box. There's three packages inside, which is great because you don't have to worry about them going bad since there's three packages. So I will freeze two and just keep one out. I think that is everything, you guys. I'm probably forgetting a couple random things here and there that I already put away and forgot about. But I hope you guys enjoyed my huge BJ's haul. Again, I spent $800. I did have quite a few coupons. I think I had like 25 bucks in coupons. But even after the coupons with tax and everything, it was like 802. So this will definitely last me for a while. Please thumbs up for more BJ's hauls or hauls in general. And I hope you guys all have a great day. Bye.